What is up my Irish Bagels and welcome to some Modern Warfare gameplay and today guys this is the second section of attachments and it is going to be optics so let's get straight into it guys. So the first optics is operator reflex sight. Reflex sight of American origin provides higher precision. Now the pro is aiming sight picture and the con is aim down sight speed is reduced. The second optics is corp combat hollow sight, an advanced holographic sight of American origin. Now the pro is aim in sight picture and the con is aim down sight speed is reduced. The third optics is aim up reflex sight. Reflex sight of western origin provides higher precision now most of these pros and cons are kind of the same so you're going to see a lot of repetitive pros and cons in this video so the pro is aim down sight picture or aim in sight picture and the cons are aim down sight speed is reduced the next optics is scout combat optic precision reticle with three times magnification for use in all lighting conditions. Of course, the pro is aim and sight picture, and the con yet again is reduced aim down sight speed. The fifth optics is hybrid scope west alt precision reticle with one times and four times magnification modes. Now, of course, the pro is reflex and scout toggle and there are three cons in this one optic toggle speed aim down sight speed and idle sway control are all reduced the sixth optics is apx5 holographic sight advanced holographic sight of russian origin now of course the pro aim in sight picture and con is aim down sight speed reduced Another optics is hybrid scope precision reticle with one times and four times magnification modes. The pros are reflex and scout toggle and optic toggle speed is increased. Now the cons are aim down sight speed and idle sway control are both reduced. The next optics is Merc scout optic. A precision reticle with three times magnification for use in all lighting conditions. Now, the pro is aim in sight picture, and the con, of course, as usual, is aim down sight speed is reduced. The ninth optics is sniper scope, scope used for fighting at extreme ranges. Now, of course, the pro is the zoom level, and the cons are both aim down sight speed and idle sway control they are both reduced another attachment in optics is the viper reflex sight a reflex sight of russian origin provides higher precision now the pro of course is aiming sight picture and the con is aim down sight speed is reduced up next in optics we have the gi mini reflex the gi miniature reflex optic features a wide tin frame for an unobstructed sight picture now the pro of course aim and sight picture and the con is aim down sight speed the 12th optics is monocle reflex sight a reflex sight of russian origin provides higher precision yet again the pros and cons are the same aim and sight picture for the pros and the con is aim down sight speed is reduced the second last optics we have is variable zoom an advanced scope used for fighting at extreme ranges now there are two pros and two cons to this attachment the pros are zoom level and magnification toggle now the cons are aim down sight speed and idle sway control they are both reduced last but not least in optics we have the hybrid scope west canted just like the hybrid scope west alt but this is slightly different 
the precision reticle with one times and four times magnification modes now the pros well there's only one pro which is reflex and scout toggle and the cons are optic toggle speed aim down sight speed and idle sway control all three of them are reduced what is up my Irish bagels and welcome to some modern warfare gameplay and today guys this is the second section of attachments and it is going to be optics so let's get straight into it guys